How about another question? Here's another question. Uh, I live in the Midwest, and my state has a very big state fair every year that I've gone to ever since it was a kid. I recently found out my state fair has a husband calling contest, which is basically a contest where wives compete to see who can call their husband in for supper the best. Like if they were on a farm. Uh -huh. I think, yeah, got it. I think that it'd be fun to participate in this contest, but unfortunately I don't have a husband. I really want to yell at my fake husband for prize money. Is it ethical for me to enter this contest? And if so, how would I do it? Mm. Ethical uh, is a funny word to use there. Yeah. Is it ethical? Yeah. Sure, it's a, yeah. You're, You're not a lying about a law degree. <sighs> Let's talk about this contest. This is from yeah. Husbandless Hopeful in Iowa. Um, if, if they, if it's just that they, if it's just wives allowed to call their farm husbands to, suff, to supper, uh -huh. I mm -hmm. think that it would be good to do unethical to the contest. Yes. I think, you yeah. know what I mean? If it's, I would argue that if you entered the contest without a husband and yelled so good that mm. your future husband showed up, you automatically win. Like you um, yell and someone walks up and is like, I, I heard the call and I had to come. Hi, I'm Jerry, right? And it's like, wow. Wow. That's a win, so right? good. I have uh, just some samplings. I've been, I found a uh, uh, an Iowa PBS report about a similar contest. Okay. Perhaps it is this one, who knows? Uh, and I just wanted to, if you guys want to get an idea of sort of what we're talking about, um, I, I'll play that clip for you now. Please be silent. Bob! 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 <coughs> Hurry up! I don't want to be late! Mm. I don't want to be late to the great Iowa State Fair! Bob, hurry, hurry! Bob, Robert, Dean! That's cool. <laughs> huh, that was not at all what I was expecting. No. Yeah. So it's, do you have to yell Bob? Everybody yells Bob. Everybody's married to, it sounds like Robert Dean. It just seems to me like you could win by just being like, hey, and then be like, oh, I'll be right there. And you're like, that's how good I yell. That's how yeah. good I yell. I don't have to do, or just or walk he just up, yell like supper, or just, just text walk them. Walk up, up to, onto the stage and hold onto your temples and close your eyes and then have a, a paid professional walk onto the stage like, did you call me? And you'd be like, money, please. Prize, money, now. Give it to me. I've won. Checking back in. Here's our fourth place winner. Yoo-hoo! Key! Key! Yoo-hoo! That's strong. Cuckoo! Cuckoo! The clock says... That was strong. That's powerful. That's that's, <sighs> that's a powerful that's a powerful call. Is the husband's name in that scenario King? I think it was Keith. Keith. Okay, it did sound Keith. like she was just yelling, King! King! The clock King. says dinner. <laughs> I do you think she decided to do a cuckoo thing like halfway through? Yes. Like, I'm gonna dip into this. She just the motivation hit and she's like, you know what? This wasn't the direction I was gonna go, but and you know what? Here's the sad thing. She probably could have gotten third if she had just stuck with her. Yeah. Ring. I think the judges probably saw that flip flop in the middle and they're like, mm, nope, no mm, husband's nope. coming she, to that. No husband will arrive for that. <gasps> Here's our uh, first place winner. Just last one I'm going to dip on you guys. Here we go. Roy? Roy! <laughs> Can you hear me? You get yourself in here right now. Come on. You know you're going to be late again, and you know that I want to get there on time. Roy! Roy, 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 Roy! <laughs> Impossible! <laughs> no. Roy! Fuck yes. That's, that's, don't even enter. Oh my God. If that's the heat you have to go up against, unless don't you are going to come enter. correct, do not enter. Is that really the thing that any human being ever is doing on a regular basis to call to another living human being ever? Travis, like farms if, are big. Farms are so farms big. Farms are big, Travis. I know, but big. I'm saying. I like the, the soft Roy's yeah. that definitely won't get Roy inside. Mm -hmm. 
It began with some quiet Roy's that you knew weren't going to work, yeah. Bonnie. So I feel like it's a little bit of a, 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 a honeypot situation. So I didn't appreciate that. But overall, great calling. Well, I like. I hope you want $100,000. I like the subtle Roy because mm. a subtle Roy is good if it turns out you just didn't see him in the periphery and Roy is like three feet to your left, right? And you're like, mm. Roy? I'm and Roy's here. like, I'm right here. And you're like, I'm oh, here, thank God. Okay. Do you but all because if you started off with a powerful Roy, and then you have subtle Roy standing next to you, and he's like, that was too powerful. You could have been subtle. I'm right here. Right. Okay. That's Do fair. Do you think there's people listening to this podcast who just got no. ASMR for, <laughs> who just got ASMR for the first time, and they're like, ah, oh, damn it. I, <laughs> That's what I want. I, I want that now, and it's so scarce. It's such a scarce resource. There's not enough husband calling to go around. Damn. Um.